See, we're back, everyone. Welcome back to God of War, and we're in Elfheim, which is, uh, as we saw last time, cold and dark. Not as green. It's not easy being green. But here we are. My wife is dancing to the left of me. I see the elves <laughs> continuing their war. Yeah, she's adorable. Watch for things being better in Alpha. Um, dead elf. Ooh, treasure. <gasps> treasure chest. Yikes! Bimble winter hit Alfheim hard. No. Storms have plagued Alfheim's deserts long before Whoa. Bimble winter. Are we sure? Whee! Come here, lore. Tasty, tasty lore. A living desert. A living desert, huh? Ah. All right. The Jewel of Alfheim is our most sacred and fertile desert, teeming with an unequal diversity of life. From the majestic Hafkufa and their dulcet Song of the Sands to the wide arrays of turtles and lizards found in the Hadratta and the abundant herds of the gazelle and ibex roaming the shifting dunes. All creatures of the desert are given breath by the grace of the light. Take a moment to witness the grandeur and reflect. Keep well thy realm. Yeah, it's not keeping well anymore. Don't know how to break it to you. But I know how to break these. Yay, treasure. See if I don't actually catch myself clicking my um, buttons all the time now. Okay, so I guess we're going back up. Whee! I'll meet you on the other side. Okay, Tyr, bye. What if I want you to stay with us? Hold on. I hear something out there. Something big. It's in pain. Whee! What do you hear? Feels like some kind of animal. How could anything live in a storm like that? Plenty of caves under the desert. Not exactly a paragon of comfort, but the dark elves get on best they can. There's one. Oh, cute little bats. I am not killing a bat. I have killed many wildlife in this game, but I am not killing a bat. Done here, boys and girls. We're just climbing up. Hopefully, find a path. There, the Temple of Light. Groa's shrine is at the top. Boop. Like that shrine. Is everything okay? Hi, old friend. Just looting on your chests. We'll be right along. My dad likes lube. Yes, yes I do. Ah, very well. How dare you criticize me, Atreus? Like you don't like loot. Who doesn't like loot? A bitter at the fact that he tried to break one with his fist and ended up hurting himself. It's true. It was hilarious. He should have known better. Gunny, don't run over your mama. Freya never bothered Bugums. returning to Alfheim, did he, Mimir? I know. I assumed the fate of his own realm took precedence. I see you, Boy, little asshole. Freya's brother? Yes. No. Cut from a different cloth for that one. You hit me with your toy. Oh, 
Oh, I'm sure there's an easier angle. Like here. Wow, what a hole. Couldn't resist. There's a barricade up ahead. What are those shiny rocks? Twilight stone. A rare material that can take we'll millennia to form. Through. Majestic, isn't it? Huh. Occasionally, the light of Alfheim will bind to a rock and crystallize, growing like moss on a fallen tree. <laughs> Truly a wonder of the Nine Realms. Okay, so how do we get through it? Oh, no, I don't think that's... Oh, I didn't know it could do that. So that's what we're doing. We're reflecting. Oh, <laughs> very clever. Maybe there's nothing else out there. Atreus, you're still not dead. That's good. Not dead is always good. Um, hmm. Yep. Okay, we're just gonna jump down. That's fine. Pack silver. Okay, that's still up that way. Maybe. Ooh, Ooh purple thing. Ooh. More inspiring lyricism from the mind of Crassia. Crassia's poems, afterlife abandonment. The Kvasir work of brilliance that, if misunderstood, proves the ignorance of the reader. Stick, rope, tar, black, skin, handprint, baby, crying, shower, stink, death, beach, grubs, delicious, bomb, piss. Death Stranding. <laughs> Afterlife abandonment. Love it. Absolutely love it. Weird. Oh, ricochets between targets. More. R1 repeatedly. Do I want to kill my R1 button? <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, so. Nope. Freya's brother. How was he involved? Long ago, Freya of the Vanir traveled to Alfheim, where he discovered a once beautiful land devastated by war. Using his divine powers, he set about cultivating a tenuous peace among the elves. Gunny, be good. When is he not being rude? <laughs> Did you mention how that piece fell apart as soon as he left? I was getting to it. You hear that? Oh, oh no. That's enough, please. You don't need to do this. We don't want to hurt you. We do not have a choice. 
We're the ones who freed the life. I don't care. Why are you fighting us? We helped you last time. Atreus, focus. Yeah, I'm kind of surprised you didn't uh, immediately think, oh, wait a second. Uh, last time we were here, Dad almost died. Most unfortunate. Mm -hmm. They attacked us. More will follow once we're inside. Nope. Is there truly no other way? Not like they're giving us much of a choice. So your father said. I'm just, I'm just naive, I suppose. No. Just an optimist, old friend. That's the thing. I'm an optimist as well, but I know there's some people that just... There's no getting through them because they're the ones who have to change. You can hope all you want to change something, but... Tribute to Freya, made by the elves. He must have left it here when he raced back to Vanaheim. What is this? A charm to ward off nightmares. In this case, Freya's. Well, knowing the elves, there are probably more tributes to find. Best we move on for now, brother. Don't think we have the right tools for this one. Um. <laughs> yeah, so for... tall. We came in from the top last time. Didn't realize all this was even down here. It's an older gate, built to promote cooperation between the elves. But it looks like it's been sealed for some time. Hmm. I'll go first. Atreus, let me know when I've reached halfway. So, uh, what's happening right now? This seal is meant to represent the balance of the realm when Freyr was here. Light and dark, working together in harmony. How's that look, Atreus? Good, I think. Father, now you go. Unfortunately for Alfheim, Freyr couldn't accept his sister's decision to marry Odin. He returned to Vanaheim and left this realm to its fate. Mm. To be fair, the Aesir did set him on fire that one time. What does that to switch controllers? Hmm. The door should have opened. Are you sure it's balanced? Controller yeah, after this episode. Should be playing the realm better. isn't. Not anymore. Father, try pulling it the other way. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And here, you keep pushing forward. I was gonna say, because we kind of, uh... Fine work, Atreus. Shall we? Yeah, let's knock. <sighs> Hi, lady. What's a dark elf statue doing in the light temple? That's just how they looked before the division. The division? Yes. The elves weren't huh. always split between light and dark, you know. This statue depicts the elves before the war, hmm. before they discovered the power of the light. Oh. And before they essentially corrupted themselves. Or split themselves. Mm-hmm. Solid light. Get something from yes. Things. The stone briefly imparts a bit of light to your axe. That's useful. You would think I'm playing a game or something, but no, I'm just getting beat up by our dog. Gunny, why are you so bad? What's that sound? No sense in why spoiling the surprise. Attention? You had my attention all day. All day long. All day long, you had my attention. You don't need it now. No, is it itched? It's the light. Did you disagree? <laughs> I've never seen the Lake of Souls so volatile. Aye. Fimple winter, you reckon? Of course. Making the light unstable. So the base of this light well 
That's the Lake of Souls. You can tell if you're trying to pick yes. me back or After the creation of the Nine Realms, pets. fallen souls began to gather down in those waters. Oh, wow. When the elves discovered its potential, they built this temple to harness that energy. A smashing success, to say the least. Many of them became addicted to their newfound power, and thus, the Light Elves were born. Mm. Interesting. Not surprising, but interesting. Power does indeed have a bad habit of corrupting. Ah, yeah. Think a little taller? Yeah, I think a little bit. It's not too much, right? Right. <laughs> well done. Though I imagine our light elf friends will be less than pleased. No, nah, they're fine. Ooh, pretty music. They did a wonderful job on actually, like, creating this world. Speaking of Light Elves, let me try talking to them again. They may just to let these two do the other. Maybe you can throw those back at them! Um, totally just cut that one in half by accident. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, I love that juggling. You will not. Oh, you didn't need that arm anyways. You're doing bad things with it. I agree. Here, they came across on light bridges, but now the bridges are gone. I have an idea to get us across. That's nice. I have an idea to look around for loot. Lucky for us, swearing off violence doesn't mean he can't disfigure some architecture. This way. Oh, good. Ryan awaits. <laughs> Whee! Whee! <laughs> Treasure. Kratos, where are you going? Treasure. He's just looking around. He does this. Carry on. Carry on. No treasure. We gotta, we gotta pick it up. Yep. Treasure. I knocked it down. I just love a trace. He does this sometimes. <laughs> I just want, I want Kratos to do something, like, completely random, and then Atreus just be like, yeah, no, this is new. <laughs> the temple looks so different than I remember. It was all broken and covered in hive stuff last time we were here. These elves use Alfheim's light to enhance the temple, yeah. and themselves by the look of I it. I think so. They definitely look more dangerous than last time. Oh, those were just the foot soldiers. They'll get more dangerous the further up we go. Yep. Great. Oh boy! You can, you can tell Atreus is so happy. More killing! Just what he loves to do. So if these elves use the light to build doors and make themselves stronger, what do the Dark Elves want with it? 
to return it back to its source. To them, the natural resources of Alfheim are sacred, none more so than the light itself. Aye, the light elf success came at a terrible price. Alfheim's once lively desert withered into a storm-ridden wasteland soon after the creation of this temple. There's more Twilight Stone up there. That was not what I was trying to do. So I was right, it is that one. That is a wall. No. So what am I running into with that? Like, am I missing an angle? Yes. Treasure. Yes. What became of Kavazir? Ripped apart by his audience. Well, one member of his audience. Well, Thor. Visions after. In which Kavazir provides readers with their own tools for crafting stories. Visions after rest. Lay in wait for explorers, crafted by the imps, and filled with music, joy, or horror. Among these fanciful realms lie endless creation and possibilities where the limit is one's own imagination. No, I don't... Because these should all be Sony properties? I think it's dreams. Dreams? Yeah, dr like visions Pikmin, after rest. Yeah, yeah so it's they dreams. They look like Pikmin. They do look like Pikmin there. But yeah. Pikmin. You can't say they don't look like Pikmin. They, they certainly did. Okay, Scotty's Edge. Okay. Tempest. See, I like the Winter's Bite. I don't have any heavy runes. Sad. Like skills. Do said skills, pay said bills. Okay. You get so little XP by yourself. Oh. There's gotta be a better angle on that Twilight Stone. No, I just returned it too early. More light elves ahead. I'll handle this. Uh, maybe that's not a great idea. Damn it, Tear! Oh, there, friends. Yeah, Salutations. We mean you no harm. Tear, get back. Hit the light on. Oh, <laughs> 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 
Bye. they keep fighting. The Dark Elves want the souls and the light left alone. But the Light Elves want to keep using them. That's the long and short of it. Aye. So then, which side is right? Rarely is it so simple. I'm not our place to say. This is an Elven conflict. I said as much the last time we were in Elven. Mm -hmm. Right. No, <laughs> right. I believe the phrase that Atreus is, uh... Hoping to not hear is, I told you so. <laughs> and the phrase I would really love to tell Atreus right now is, I told you so. <laughs> Just making sure there's no way over here to get to that chest. I'm going to find you, Chest. I will find you, and I'm going to open you. Just you wait. Maybe not today, maybe not tomorrow, but sometime. They sure made a lot of these light doors. Huh. Fortifications. Aye, none too eager to let the Dark Elves run the roost again. There's a chain. And a gear. Damn you, tree branch, you're in the way of my axe. You would think that I could use the axe then. The angle looks right. You want know to also look for right, Atreus? The treasure over here. I don't think that's the way up to the shrine. We know. There's a chest over here. Oh, I see it now. Forgive my impatience. Oh, tricky. Be a way to get your axe behind this crate, right?
Okay, all right with that. There you go. I got it. Okay, now. I was like, let, oh, I was like, let me down! I don't think that was the chest I was hoping for before, but. Much further to the Dragon's Bane, Graham. It's what it once was. Oh, okay. Bye. Relic. Short time. Burst of rage implies stun to nearby enemies. Okay. I'll try it. Oh no. Rage! Left leg! <laughs> Behind you! Watch your left! Back to it then. I really do love how casual they are about being attacked out of nowhere. So like, also, this is very pretty. No? no? Okay, you said the angle was right. Why not simply hold it in place? That's what I was going to do. Excellent. Let's continue our ascent, yes? Right side! Keep going! Oh, are you... Okay. Wow, those exploding nightmares really suck. Jesus Christ! Above you, it's coming! Everything with explosion, exploding damage, does so much more in this game. Mamiya, do you understand these poems? Well, there's always meaning if you look hard enough, brother. It's all. Hold on, spirits within walls. Oh God, ah, uh, spirits within walls. Okay, uh. A tale showcasing the power of visual art by Cavasir. Oh, uh, yeah, because this is, um, the VR game with the, the, the art and the paintbrush. Mm -hmm. Gentle boy and his brush found kinship along the walls. His creations, playful spirits, brought joy to one and all. The town, once empty, now flush with color and laughter. The boy hailed a hero, though merely a talented drafter. His mission saved his home, threatened by seas and disuse. His weapon, imagination. Blues, reds, purple, and chartreuse. Wonderful. What you bring to it? <laughs> Oh, 
I actually didn't know that was a PlayStation only game. Hmm. And now I can't remember the name of it, but I have it. <laughs> I suppose I'll leave you to it. Oh! You will not. Watch your left! Join him. Yet. Oh, that's it, buddy. Give me my health back. Fuck you. Well, that was violent. Well, <sighs> I'll meet you on the other side. Whoa, Tyr can really jump. Bye. Hey, look, a thing. Kick. <gasps> Is it? <gasps> I knew it. See? It did end up being today. Mm -hmm. Found it. <clears throat> Yeah, treasure. Treasure? No, no treasure. Ooh. I don't know which one of my fingers that was, but that was one of my fingers, if that came onto the mic. Sure, let's go over here. Whee! Wait, no, if this is the way, then we want to go the other way. Why do we want to go the other way? Because probably treasure. That's the wrong another chest. He's getting the hang of it. I've never seen the light elves with so much control over the temple. That's on us. They must have anointed a new temple guardian. Spartal Yoffer's counterpart. The Dark Elf King. Yes, he's in the light now, too. Whee! Okay, so I'm going to have to shake it real good. I'll shake it, shake it. I was like, that's the wrong way. Oh, wait, no, never mind. I see. Another chest. Got it. I got to I need to turn it too, don't I? Oh. 
Well, it's nice to know that this actually is a real physics-based game, because not every puzzle that involves something like hitting stuff is going to knock back and forth just because you hit it the wrong way. Because the, the thing is right below us, so... Is there a way to turn it? And I can't throw the axe like this. to find a way over there. Treasure. We might as well, you know, collect artifacts and stuff. A rune engraved release. An accessory. Oh, armor. Accessories are for the boy. Uh, first run runic arrow from a full quiver deals increased damage. Okay. Yeah, go for it. Stone on the ground. I wonder if we could use Twilight Stone against them. Huh. 
You mean like that? We can continue up this way. You know, I gotta explore. Come. Do what you must. Light up on the left. Right side, it's coming. We will stop here and then pick up in the middle of a fight then. <laughs> so I hope you are, all are enjoying. Honestly, I I like learning a, more about the elves and how essentially the... Yeah, the light elves actually are corrupted elves because they essentially went kind of power mad. And are using pretty much the souls of the dead to uh, kind of make their lives easier, which is... I don't see it as, like, gray, but, you know, eh, it is. It's, a, it's all interesting points of view, so. We will carry on from here. I hope you're all enjoying, and I'll see you in the next one. Sorry. <laughs>